Another thing, oh my goodness. And mine was, uh, I had a governor on it because it's a fleet vehicle for crazy people who like cars like me to get out and try them. Capped off at 85. I, I'm telling you, I took it off autopilot and I hit that gas. I went like 55 to 85, like nothing. And when I say like nothing, I don't mean it just got up and went. I'm saying it silently got up and went. I mean, it was unbelievable. It did not jerk. It did not make a noise. It did not feel like I was accelerating, but I accelerated 30 miles an hour, probably in about a second and a half on the highway. So there's your firsthand Tesla Model S 100D experience. Uh, the P100 is the fastest production vehicle on the market. That was not the one I was in. I believe the model I was in goes for about north of $70,000. Uh, they just released the Model 3, obviously. There's a lot of reservations for those. Those are going in the mid-30s to 40. That's the more, you know, just the kind of affordable car for people. The affordable Tesla. So, and they're working on that semi-trailer. Just keep an eye out on Tesla. I mean, they've been around a while, and they're not just doing fun little techie car things. They're making functional cars with the goal in mind to reduce traffic deaths make fun cars, and reduce emissions. And that's what they're setting out to do. And my first-hand experience has showed me that they are on the right path to doing that. So get out there and check them out. Check it out for yourself before you form an opinion.